38, 2005, when Shanika Anderson left all the way from Maxfield Avenue. She left there with her mother, Ruth Green, and she went to the Coronation Market just to help out with her mom. On that horrific day, she was tricked into a patty and a box juice by some unscrupulous criminal. This unscrupulous criminal took poor little Shanika Anderson all the way to Raytown, where he sexually assaulted her. He sexually assaulted her vaginally and anally, and then he strangled poor little Shanika to death. I can also remember the year 2009. This poor, beautiful little boy, his name is Courtney Walker, but they call him Hard Life Sufferer, and he did suffer. On the 20th of March, 2009, his mother went to river, and while his mother was at the river, she said, I'm out of soap, little Courtney. And being the hard-working little boy that he was, he didn't hesitate. He said, of course, mommy. And he ran on the way to his house. On the way to his house, he said, I'm not going to take the main road. I'm going to take this little shortcut. And he probably bumped into something that he should not have seen. And two grown men sexually assaulted this little nine-year-old boy. They sexually assaulted this little nine-year-old boy and they stabbed him over 57 times. I went to the spot where his body lay. Ladies and gentlemen and people out there, I'm still taken back to know that we can do this to our children. Two boys were found in the Trelawney area. Based on the reports on the radio and on the news, both these boys were buggered and both these boys were strangled to death. It's very, very disturbing for me. How can a father molest a six-year-old, ladies and gentlemen? Look at me, look at my face, I'm dead serious. How can a father molest his own child if this is true? It was alleged, ladies and gentlemen, that this was Monday afternoon, somewhere in St. Andrew, when a father and a mother had a domestic dispute. The woman was beaten with a two by four and later on, a little six-year-old, I don't know if it's a little boy or a little girl, was found bleeding profusely from his anus. Today I'm very sad because we have lost a very, very, very beautiful little boy. His name is Lyndon Madison. He was only 11 months, 3 weeks and 2 days old. He was 5 days shy of his one day birthday. This happened in another Bay St. Mary when this poor little boy was up to death actually killed by his mother. Go back to the days of when it takes a village to raise a child. Look how much time he said that. Eh? A phone responsibility for take care of phone pitney. They never ask to be here. You put them here. So you must take care of them, my brethren. Me upset, Rasta. Fire upon a child. Molesta.